CBS 46 News presents Public Affairs on Peach. Good morning, kids. Get out your giggle boxes, ready for a lot of laughing the next half hour. The Center for Puppetry Arts is letting animals take over the stage for their latest productions. Hey, good morning, and welcome to Public Affairs on Peach. I'm your host, Adam Murphy. Today, we're talking all about, as I said, the Center for Puppetry Arts. Segment one this half hour is going to be a little bit of an overview and what's playing now at the Center for Puppetry Arts. And we have some stuff not only for the kids, but also the adults. And we want to introduce some folks here on the program today. Tell us who you are and what you do. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm Aretta Baumgartner. I'm so proud to be the Education Director at the Center for Puppetry Arts. And um, it is the largest nonprofit devoted to puppetry in the country. So that's part of the pride, man, as I am at this amazing, unique treasure. And speaking of treasure. Yeah, who's <laughs> that over there? We have a puppet treasure right here. Can you tell them who you are? <laughs> I'm Silly Puppy. <laughs> Ah, Silly Puppy, welcome to the program. Thanks. The name says it all. That's Silly Puppy. Dressed for the program, too. Looks sharp today. Thank you very much. <laughs> you know, normally I don't even wear a shirt. <laughs> yeah, he did. He stepped it up for you all this morning. He stepped yes, it up for you. Yes, yes. And the twirly cap, I mean, just really pulls the outfit Thank you very together, much. I would you, say. You, you know, do you want to yeah, invest in the twirly cap? Well, I've been, yeah, if you don't you mind. Oh, oh, what nice. an honor. That wasn't that good. <laughs> He wasn't that good. Does he actually fly? Like, if you twirl the hat, does he fly? Try it. So you ready? Yeah. Let's see. Count me it. down. Count me in. Okay. One, two, three. Dun, 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 dun. That's as high as I get. That, that's all right. That's okay. all right. It was Calm good. Calm down. It's okay. <laughs> all right. Just happy to be on the show this morning, right? Aren't we all? Absolutely. So is Silly Puppy uh, a part of a program that's going on right now, the Center for Puppetry Arts? Silly Puppy is from a cast of a show called Captain Healthy and Safety Dog. Oh. And so that show is one of our distance learning uh, puppet productions, okay. which means that it can go to anyone anywhere across the country through video conferencing equipment and live puppetry that way. Though he is not in the show that's currently running, he's sort of our ambassador. <laughs> Silly I Puppy see. is here. So um, he is not in the current show. The current show running is actually guest artists are all the way from Minneapolis. They are fantastic. Open Eye Figure Theater is at the Center for Puppetry Arts right now. They have one more week of a run of a fabulous show, which okay. is My Life as a Fairy Tale an original take on The Ugly Duckling, which is great. And Silly Puppy, you had the pleasure, I think, of seeing that show on. Uh -huh. It you... was wonderful. So tell me what you liked about it, <laughs> Silly Puppy. Well, let's see. There's this lady, she, she's a clown, and she plays Hans Christian Andersen, who wrote uh, The Ugly Duckling and The Little Mermaid, and she plays with paper and balloons, and it was a lot of fun. Oh, neat. Made me laugh really hard. Very cool. So anything can be a puppet is kind of what that show Yeah, that's right. right. It was called Found Object Puppetry. Cool. Found Object mm -hmm. puppetry. She has lots of things as puppets that aren't really puppets. Cool. Yeah. All right. Even <laughs> yeah. Of course, anything can be a puppet. All you need is imagination, right? Uh huh. Right. And I love that animals can be puppets too. I, obviously, he's a puppet. Don't tell him that he's a puppet. Wait. What's she saying? Nothing. What? Nothing. Silly puppy. Um, I have animals, a question. Sure, I have, silly absolutely. puppy. I have a question. Huh. All right. Does your tongue always stick out while you're talking? What are you talking about? <laughs> What's wrong with my tongue? L let me see how wet your tongue is here. Oh, yeah, here. Yeah. Here. Right. here. Wait, hey, hey. Sorry. Did you see what just happened there? I do that too. <laughs> <laughs> the silly puppy, of course, is again not in the uh, current show. He's also not in the next show. The next show running okay. is, though, filled with a barnyard of amazing animals, right? That show is called Click Clack Moo cows that type and it is a, an adaptation of a terrific book by Doreen Cronin with uh, pictures by Betsy Liu and it's an award-winning book that is getting a premiere at the Center for Puppetry Arts an amazing adaptation directed and adapted by our artistic director John Ludwig and it has incredible live music in it Adolph Amick is our composer as well cool. as a musician for the show and um, click clack move oh, oh, oh. click, click. Clack, moo. Uh, uh, uh. Click, clack, clack, moo. Good job. Hey, well I'm done. On. Right. And you can't help but, you know, kind of go to well, the Well, I'm there. glad because when yes. you come to the show, there will be moments for you to be a oh, part of it, too. Oh, okay, good. Well, you know, I'm a daddy. I have three young mm -hmm. children, so this, this should be uh, right up my alley. Right? Absolutely. The yeah. Center for Puppetry Arts has programming for all ages. Okay. We do our sweet spot, kind of, are those uh, children and family audiences, but we'll talk about this maybe a little bit more later. We do have programming for all ages, though, so you don't have to have children to enjoy the magic of puppetry. You don't 
have to have children to enjoy the Center for Puppetry Arts, though again, it's kind of our sweet oh, spot. Of course, and you know, when you are a parent and mm -hmm. you have young children, it's, it's like reliving your childhood. I'm a kid with a big heart, you know? Absolutely. So, a uh, big kid with a big heart as well. So, this is uh, a lot of fun. We enjoy this kind of stuff. Tell me about how long these shows last when you come down. Uh, to the Center for Puppetry Arts and what the admission is and how it helps the organization. Oh, absolutely. Now the show is only one part of the experience at the Center for Puppetry Arts oh. and it's an amazing part of the experience. So we'll kind of start there. Okay. So our puppet theater performances, live puppet theater performances, they last between 45 minutes and 50 minutes. Part of the magic of that show though is afterwards you get to sort of go behind the scenes with the puppeteers because ah. they do a question answer. Fun. Don't they? That's a lot of fun. It is. They what show you how to use the puppets. Got and it. How they do certain special effects. Whoa. Things like that. Whoa. So not only do you get to enjoy the show, <laughs> you get a little bit of information about how those shows come to life and how the puppets go. <laughs> That's my bite? sweet spot. <laughs> it, oh, okay. Speaking of sweet spot, there it is. I didn't think he... Good stuff. I didn't think he bites. <gasps> no, he doesn't. He's okay. getting excited again. Oh, it's excited to be on this program with Adam. Yeah, that's, that's really right. It's it just it's amazing. It's a lifelong yeah. dream. Hi, Mom. <laughs> oh, hi, yeah. You All can right, so we're going to have a whole lot of fun here this next half hour, and I'm going to get involved in some of this. I can't wait. We're going to learn more about the Center for Puppetry Arts. And Silly Puppy, hang on over there, okay? We'll get okay. you a bone or a little treat <gasps> or something like that. If you <gasps> behave... Where? Where? Yeah, oh, just, he didn't say oh, puppy yeah. treats, he said puppetry, Center for Puppetry. That's right, <laughs> that's, that's, that's exactly <laughs> right. Good one. All right, so for more details and more information, it's easy to find out how and when and who and what and where and why and all that by puppet.org. Hey, we'll be back right after this short break to tell you how you can get the best deal by purchasing a membership to the Center for Puppetry Arts. We're going to have a lot of fun, so hope you come back right after this short break. <laughs> 